What's going on, everybody? This is Bishop Brad coming to you on another pod episode from Refining Fire Chilies. Coming to you on the Cascabel Morado. The Cascabel Morado, everybody. Look at this cute little pet. Look at this thing. The Cascabel Morado. Now, let me give you all a little bit of history on this magical pepper. This pepper comes from the original Cascabel but was bred to have thicker flesh than the cascabel. They are smaller and don't make a rattling sound like the cascabel when dried and then shaken. They, they ripen from a beautiful purple to red. Oh, wow. The flavor is rich and slightly smoky. In fact, it's very complex. So this is going to be one of those ones that's hard to describe. The cascabel morado chili plants are very productive and grow two to three feet tall. Uh, the the Cascabel Morado peppers are great for stuffing with cheese, pickling, sauces, and salsa. Uh, yes, they can be dried and used as a seasoning for soups, stews, and meats, everybody. The Cascabel Morado. Cheers. Thick, walled, and juicy. Unique. A very unique. Uh, it does have smoky undertones in it, but most importantly, a very different flavor profile than I'm used to. I would say it is a very great tasting pod. Hard to explain. A tad sweet. It's good, juicy. Much more thicker walled. <laughs> Mild, there's no heat. Man, that's a unique pro flavor profile. But an overall delicious tasting pod. Everybody, the Cascabel Morado. Cascabel Morado. You can go to www.superhotchilies.com. www.superhotchilies.com. Get your seeds for the Cascabel Morado, dude. That was a good chili. Very good. Baby, I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Y'all come like the like the video, share, and subscribe. I'll see y'all in the next one. Y'all have a good one. Bye-bye.